my name is Perla Munoz. Welcome to my channel. On today's video, I am going to be saying 30 facts about myself. My name is Perla Munoz. I am 22 years old and I am married to my high school sweetheart and very best friend. His name is Matthew Munoz. Here's a few pictures of us. This was actually our engagement picture. Um, and this is, this is my favorite picture. I love it. Here's us. married in 2015 I was 18 years old as we got married we actually did not have a honeymoon we actually saved our uh, not saved our money but we got the money and we bought furniture with that money the following year and our anniversary anniversary we actually went to San Francisco and we absolutely fell in love with it we have a dog me and my husband have a dog uh, his name is Roscoe he is a Labrador mixed with Border Collie come here come here boy Matt actually found him on his way back home from work and he was only six months old so we we got him he brought him home we got his shots and he's a really really good boy he is now nine months come here say hi he has the most beautiful eyes i do have a mole on my left foot and it's in the shape of a heart when i was little i was watching a movie and in this movie there was a little i can't remember if it was a boy or a girl but they were they were putting an egg inside the, the microwave thinking that it was gonna become a chick, a baby chick. I wanted a baby chick. In that movie, the, the egg, he microwaves it and then becomes a chick, a baby chick. So he, when he opens the microwave, you see a little tiny cute baby chick. So I'm like, oh, I want a, a baby chick. I think I was about like what, five or six. I put my egg in the microwave. And so when I opened it, the egg popped like it went everywhere in the in the microwave, like everywhere, and it was a huge pop. So not only did I get in trouble, but I had to clean the egg. I do have three beautiful sisters, beautiful, beautiful sisters, and an amazing brother. I absolutely love adventures and camping and hiking. I love outdoors. I do attend CDA church with my husband, and it's an amazing church. If you don't go there, you totally should. You would love it. Everyone there is so friendly so beautiful they love jesus and they talk about him non-stop it's amazing y'all should come i got baptized with my husband on 2018 and it was a beautiful moment i got saved in 2017 i naturally have curly hair curly curly wavy hair I actually have five scars i have five scars so i have one right here this one i fell when i was i don't know if y'all can see it but like if i if i if I smile, like you can see, oh right here, I don't know if you can see that right there, right here. So it's a little baby scar, when I was little I fell at the cafeteria in my school and it kind of split open and I had to go to the hospital and get some stitches, so that's scar number one. Um, I've never broken a bone in my whole life. I love, love, love taking photos, photography, videos, I absolutely love doing that. I love learning new things basically i love like enhancing my mind and like growing and taking stuff in cute little story now that it's kind of cold when i was little i was i think i was about like maybe within the ages of five and eight in the beginning of the colder weather so i remember i would open my, my 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 back door and i would go out in a tank top and then i would go barefoot and what i would do is i would run from my door all the way to the end of my fence. So I would run full speed with my arms open wide and I would feel the breeze of the coldness. It made me feel powerful. <laughs> so the colder weathers remind me of that time. I was actually really nervous to start YouTube. Um, I was actually debating it for like three years. And here I am. <laughs> Another fact, actually my ring. So this one, this ring, it's meaningful. My husband and I went to a, fl a, a trip, a road trip with my husband's family. And it was amazing, it was so much fun. We went to a road trip to Virginia, and then we went to New York, and then we went to Atlantic City. When we went to New York, I was like, I don't wanna wear my ring because I'm gonna lose it, right? So I put it in some tissue paper, and I put it in tissue paper, and I put it at the bottom of our suitcase. It was my beautiful, beautiful engagement ring. Then, as we're leaving New York, because we only stayed there for uh, one day. 
size. We're leaving New York and we are seven hours away because we're road tripping. I'm like, oh my gosh, where's my ring? Like, when we got to our next next stop, right? First thing I do is go check my my suitcase. And I'm like, okay. So I'm like, babe, like, please help me. Please help me find it. Like, like it has to be in here. And it's not. My mother-in-law, she's so sweet. She's like, no, tell me, tell me what, what it is. Maybe, maybe I have it. I'm like, it's because my ring, I left it in here. So she's like, oh no, Mija, I don't know. So I started crying. And I ran into the a little closet because I was too scared for them to see me cry. So I, I was bawling my eyes out. And I was so sad. And I'm like, oh my gosh. So Matt called the hotel. And they're like, oh no, we didn't see anything. So it was a very, very sad day. Very sad week. Very sad month. Because I'm like, it was a meaning. Like Matt chose this ring specifically for me. Then my mother-in-law, my sweet, sweet mother-in-law, she got me this ring. And it looks very similar. It looks very similar to um, to my, my 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 wedding ring, and so my engagement ring. I'm sorry. This is the real one, my wedding band. So I'm so glad I didn't lose this one. So she got me this one. It's a sterling ring, a sterling silver ring, and it's so beautiful. And I wear it every day. I don't take it off. My dream vacation, and actually me and Matt's both dream vacation would definitely be number one, Hawaii, Maui it's so beautiful and number two greece italy i love family i love uh family nights i love family talks my favorite shows are this is us and it's a family show that teaches you a lot about life and also a, a million little things they're both about life a lot my favorite childhood movie and the one i do watch still to this day is matilda i love that movie my first job was at Chick-fil-A and I actually really liked working there. I learned a lot about customer service. I learned a lot about talking to people. Uh, that's where I really overcame my shyness, I believe. I do love bonfires. Oh, I once cut my hair. I once cut my hair like this short. That was like two, three years ago. And I liked it for a while, but then I instant, not instantly, but I regretted it. And now it's like, really long and I like it when I was little my favorite 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 part of the playground would be the merry-go-round it was so much fun Matt and I have talked about having one in our backyard whenever we have our house so that's a little dream that we have that is all I have for today thank you so much for watching if you watch to the end thank you so much if you have any ideas or any things that you would like to see me do, please comment down below and I will do that. <laughs> this is again my first YouTube video, my first official YouTube video. I'm just here drinking me some little coffee. Actually not little, this is a huge mug, but this is like a little bit. I There's not a lot in there. So again, thank you so much for watching. I'm so excited to continue making some videos. Um, Please give this a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye! my name is Perla on this episode I am going to be saying episode <laughs> that's another fact another sad fact uh, uh, another sad fact another sad fact whoa